you join me and our stunning G80 BMW M3 in the Paramount Performance Workshop. This S58 powered M3 is already a pretty serious performance car with a three liter straight six twin turbo giving 510 horsepower and 650 newton meters of torque from factory. Here at Paramount Performance, the team work very closely with the software tuning experts at Vizu. Together, we have scoured the globe for a tuning solution that is suitable for these modern BMW M cars, which meets our exacting standards. After many, many hours of research and testing, the Berger Motorsport JB4 tuning system has been approved for sale. This is the Berger Motorsport JB4 for S58 powered BMWs. The JB4 system is a highly advanced tuning system with advanced features and significant power gains. Today, we're gonna to show you the results of a factory dyno run, how to install the JB4, and the results of a dyno run after installation. We'll also take a look at some of the functions inside the mobile app. First, we will carry out a factory dyno run to find out exactly what figures the car is putting out. So, let's get cracking with the first dyno run of the day. So let's see what the results are for our stock M3. Claimed power from factory is 510 horsepower, but our M3 hit a rather impressive 559 horsepower. Factory torque is 650 newton meters. Our car achieved 716 newton meters. Those are some very impressive factory numbers and higher than the manufacturer claims. Whilst impressive, these cars are known to deliver power figures slightly higher than their claim numbers. So this is roughly in line with what we would expect. Let's find out how the JB4 system is installed. So our workshop technician today is Matt, who's gonna be installing the JB4 for us on this BMW. Now, Matt, isn't it true that uh, a competent home mechanic should be able to fit the JB4 to their car? Yes, but we do recommend uh, that a professional installs your JB4. The process can be quite involved, it can take a couple of hours. So are we gonna be, we're gonna be unplugging sensors from the engine bay today, aren't we? Uh, yeah, that's right, but just a handful of sensors. Do we have to do any like rewiring, soldering, any permanent changes? Nothing permanent, just plug it into some sensors and connect to the OBD. While it's true that the JB4 can be installed by a competent home mechanic, if you feel uncertain about performing mechanical or electrical work on your own car, our team are here to install the JB4 tuning system for you. Just give us a call to discuss the prices and book your car in with us. To be honest, that's what I'd do. The JB4 system is available with an optional Bluetooth adapter. When combined with the mobile app, this opens up a whole raft of features that gives you convenient, full control of the JB4. More on this later. If you've opted for the optional Bluetooth adapter, and you really should, we need to get that installed on the JB4 first. We simply remove the screws on the JB4 box and connect the Bluetooth connector. Then refit the case and put the screws back in. With that done, we can start getting the JB4 installed on the car. So Matt, tell me if I'm getting any of this wrong, but I believe we now need to start getting the car safe and ready to work on. So that means locking the car, leaving it for around 10 minutes or so to make sure all the systems shut down. Then we need to remove the strut braces, the engine cover, and the driver's side airbox. Exactly. This prevents fault codes when we disconnect the sensors and it also makes it safer to work on as well. Removing these gives us access to more of the sensors. Next up, Matt has removed the plastic cover at the back of the engine bay on the driver's side and is securing the JB4 ready to route the cables. It's important to secure them safely and away from any hot or moving parts. Now we've connected the JB4 up to the map sensor using the plug with the rainbow wires, making sure the connectors are pushed firmly together. The map sensor is located at the top of the intake manifold. What's the next step, Matt? Now we need to connect to the T-map sensor. This time we're connecting the plug with the brown and black wires. 
this one can be a little trickier to access. It's also positioned close to the AC condenser pressure sensor, so make sure you get the right one. With that done, it's time to find the electronic wastegate connectors. They are on the left-hand side of the car, and you'll be using the plug with the black, purple, and blue wires this time. You'll need to remove the second airbox for this. Finally, we connect the JB4 to the OBD2 plug inside the car and neatly route the cables for a nice, tidy install. By opting for the Bluetooth adapter, we can see all sorts of useful data. You will need to download the JB4 app from the Apple App Store or from the Google Play Store. With the car running, we can see more than 40 different gauges. For example, we can see boost, oil temperature, water temperature, pedal position, and a lot more besides. We can also choose from multiple maps as well as scan for and delete error codes. The Bluetooth kit is optional, but we think it's a must have item. It just provides so much added value. With the Berger Motorsport JB4 tuning system now fully installed, let's find out the results. Impressive numbers. We have made some substantial power and torque gains here. We have added 72 horsepower and 94 newton meters of torque. Those are numbers you will definitely be able to feel on the road and on the track. And those numbers are also exactly in the region of the predicted gains from this system, which are 80 horsepower and 100 newton meters of torque. Final figures from our G80 M3 then are 631 horsepower and a massive 810 newton meters of torque. It was a quick car before, but now it's going to be incredible. I don't know about you, but I am seriously impressed with the relative simplicity and the excellent power gains delivered by the JB4 tuning system. As I mentioned earlier, if you are a competent home mechanic, this is something you could tackle yourself. However, there are some things which you need to be careful with, and there are a couple of trickier aspects to the install. For peace of mind, why not book your car in with us and have our experienced technicians complete the installation for you. If you own an S58 powered BMW M2, M3 or M4, this is an upgrade that is well worth the investment. You can find out more at paramount-performance.com or call us on 01789 77444.